Anyway, so, new topic. New topic. Can you have nasty sex? Well, I can still go to heaven. I don't know. I mean, I'm just saying, I don't know. Ooh, what I got here today? Got a pony. Look at that. Ooh, I like the pony. Uh, yeah. Let me see. Is that that's just a this yeah, bitch? Uh, like the pony. When you know how to be some one of little old baby pets. Can't ride the pet no old pony, it's pretty though, but can't ride that little bitch. Okay. Alrighty, here we go. Okay. And it's Friday. Hello. What's up? Hello. Hey, Alex, what's up, man? Doing Dragon Star Arena. How are you? That's cool. I'm gonna do my dailies, man. Like, oh, I'm gonna turn that motherfucker the right way. I can't stand for it to get his fucking. I'm gonna end up sicker than a fucking dog again, dude. Okay. <sighs> <coughs> oh god dude hey look, look at the picture I sent you man our last night was looking for you last night so we can do the try on best item yeah what did you get out of it but, but uh, did you get the skin is, uh, is that what you was after dude the skin We just fought the bus one on one first so we can learn all the mechanics right and then we'll run it next time all three bosses at the same. That's your guild you're running in with, right? Right, your guild, run them with your guild. See you in Dragon Store. Yeah. Yes. There's a lot of uncertainty in Belcart these days, yeah. but you can rest assured we'll take good care of your valuables here. <coughs> no, I am the uh, one that, uh, yeah. Let me make sure I'm giving that to the right bunch. 
there's a lot of uncertainty in Belcart these days. There's a lot of uncertainty in Belcart. Yeah, we, uh, okay, bitch, okay, we get it. We get it. There's a lot of uncertainty. Yeah. We got that. We got that. We supposed to do it tomorrow night. You got to fight all three bosses to get the skin hard mode. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they got hard. Is core. another girl that I've been with them for two years. Different one. Oh, uh, oh, it's a different, different, different bunch. Oh, okay. I thought I thought it was uh, um, the ones or the ones that they uh, uh, DC. You know what I mean? I I I figured it was those guys. Auction here in Ella Hollow. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. April the 21st. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do the day laser. Um, what's the day of the dungeons, man? Do you know? Have you done them? You already did them? Got it one hand or purple weapon. I did it. Oh, you got a one hand of purple. Yeah. What'd you get? A sword or axe? <laughs> Did you get a two hander? Uh like uh man, I think goddamn dude, we about got all the dragon sort of weapons, but the damn Almost done around eight. I almost done. I thought you'd done was was done, dude, when you said got it one hander. <laughs> I hope you get you a lightning staff, dude. That's the last one you missing, ain't it? Or no a flame staff's what you want, ain't it? Hell I Yeah I did I'm already on my heater already, both of them. D did I'm on your healer already, yeah. Let's see uh, magic. Yes, for magic, okay. Do, 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 do. Turn. Got a two-hander took her three hours to finish it, but we got it done. Oh, you got a two-hander? That's cool. <coughs> two-hander is just cool. Uh, yeah, damn. We're going to soak your dread up. Uh, see if I didn't hit my time. Okay. Uh, that's 
No, I already got all the weapon from Asylum already. No, I found Asylum down the uh, Dragon Store. Dragon Store, dude. That's what I was meant. Not Asylum, no, dra Dragon Store. That's what I meant, you know. Dragon Store Arena. So you are the one King Baharajad has placed his faith in. Yeah, I remember you just said you was running a dragon store, I was. Okay. Get away. <laughs> I mean, you know. Fuck. Yep. Just missing fire staff and electric staff. The two stabs. Yeah. They don't search yet. Oh, what's that one you sent me? What did you send me? Uh, oh, another alchemy. And my alchemy is as easy, dude. Well, and, 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 I you know, I dirted the alchemy and the enchanting. But at the moment, because they're easier, and uh, <coughs> let's see, goddamn, I need to change it. Okay, close on. <coughs> let's see here. Uh, Robe breaches ample. Man, that was the fourth way ever changed, don't they? Robe. three days to do it. They say you get more, but I don't know. I, I don't honestly feel you do. You know what I mean? Yeah, they what the hell are you over done, dude? Yeah. Okay. Now 
sword. Shitload of damn spinning, dude. Holy shit. Holy crap, man. I ain't got no fucking wax, but I gotta go some damn. And, uh, what light did you took from the last boss when you got the weapon? The first one, the second one, the third one, of the fourth one. I took the uh, when, when I got the weapon, dude. I I, I, t I took the, the 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 third light, Alex. I took the third light up, and and I got the uh, 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 I got the weapon, man. Me and that, me and that me and that dude both took the third light up. That got it. <coughs> to, to, to be uh, honest and fair, we both got in that light, man. Uh, and that's, that's that's honest, no bullshit. We both got in that light. That uh, that that run, we we sure did. And and it was the third light we took up. Or no, 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 I take it back, Alex. It was the second light that we yeah. took up. And me and him both run and got in that light because uh, the reason I got in the second one because I'd been going up the third light and, and every time I had, it had been glitchy, that third light had. Uh, so I, w I went and got in the second light instead of the one I'd normally go, uh, go, damn, yeah. I went the wrong way. Uh, than the one I normally uh, go up because I normally go up the same one every time, and and I uh, I went up the second light, and I hadn't normally did it about going up the second light. That is. <coughs> <coughs> Because I normally just go go up the same one every time. I didn't, I, you know, I didn't. It didn't strike me till you just mentioned that them lights probably matter uh, on your box. Because I, me and him both had went up that light. Because I, he told me he said you'll glitch us out going up the same light. Remember? And I told him, yeah, that one light's glitched out anyway. But I went up the second light, Alex. I, that I do remember, because I went and went up the one I hadn't normally been going up. <coughs> and, uh, come over to the black smith iron. Drew Wag. Coda and a silver enchantment rat. That's cool. Epic. Serves me some more vouchers. Uh, are you a, uh, I already know I want to uh, urge you another uh, recipe, a blue one, and uh, more resin. But uh, that's the one I went up, dude. Uh, and I'm positive of that because uh, I always went to the third light. Or the, uh, and uh, the fourth light, and I went up the second light. I said, "Fuck it, I'm not gonna glitch out because usually every time I go up them lights, I glitch out." And, and uh, everybody's been saying the third light glitched out, so I went up the uh, 
I went up to the second one, dude. Uh, that I'm positive about that. I went up to the second lap. I mean, absolutely positive of that, I, that I went up to the second lap. That's a good theory you got there on that deal, dude, because uh, I th I'm, I'm like you. I think it has something to do with the lights, too, dude. I honestly do. <coughs> Goddamn Gizzy, he wrecked the place, you prick. I swear that cat's a dick. Staff of Agility. <coughs> okay, bucket thing. I might as well just go ahead and get rid of it. I got like two or three of those. <laughs> but uh, I, I, I believe I agree with you 100% on that, or about the light deal, because uh, I'd always went, every time I went and went up the third light. Either the third or fourth light, I've always went up, but I've never uh, uh, went and went up the first or second one because everybody's always went and run straight to those, and I never did go uh, up up a light that somebody else had went up, and uh, that time I did because I didn't want to glitch the light to glitch out, and it takes a fucking long to load me in. That much I honestly am puzzled it up. It's it's the se <laughs> it's the second light I, I went up on uh, when I got the step. I, I mean honestly, I, I wouldn't bullshit you or joke you about it. It was the second light. Uh, what's today's dailies, man? I, I'll go get them. Get rid of Mazda time. Be right back. This air conditioner don't feel like it's. Yeah. That's probably because I turned it on around sitting. Yeah. I'm fucking. Freeze my balls off here in a fucking second. God damn, ain't it pretty again today, dude? It's already fucking. It, well, it's almost one now, but it's already fucking hot outside. So much. But uh, <coughs> I am positive of that, man. That uh, that's the light I went up. That fucking ghost torch. Yeah. La, 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 la. Let me go up here and get these first. And then I'll <coughs> go get the other one. But next time I run out, I'll try it, Terry, dude, because, uh, I, I'm about like you. I think the lights have uh, have something to do with it. Uh, myself on that deal because uh, I mean uh, it, it does make all the sense, all the sense in the world that it would because there's four different lights, you know. And I'd never went up at one light either. Uh, that I went up, I'd always went up the same one every time. Uh, but that third light started glitching out, man, so I quit going up. I, I know that glitch out because every time I, where it started doing that, uh, I said, fuck it, I'm not going to go up it and, and be forever loading. You know what I mean? Not that, uh, but I, I, I didn't uh, really honest honestly think that's what had anything to do with it dropping for me i just figured it that i'd finally run the motherfucker so many times that 
it uh, uh, the, my RPG got better you know <coughs> that, that, that it finally dropped for me you know because I've got like eight bows out there and fucking numerous swords and, and axes and shit and it was just the last few times I run that I kept anything I always give it away Oh shit, god damn it. I gotta go with the fighters guild and get that one. I don't know. I never really did think about it. They, you know, the lights would have had anything to do with it. But they are what takes you in or to it. So, you, you know, uh, you do have a point there. That could, that could be your drop all the way around. Next time I run it, I'll go back and get in the same one, and uh, and see if uh, if I have another good drop like that. Man, if I can get these done really, I believe I just do the two random, or not not the two randoms, but the two dailies. The 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 two regular undaunted, and not do the DLC undaunted unless it's a really good one. That way I... Which... There'll be people doing trials tonight. I, I would think. We go ahead and do these two writs. That one I got and the one you give me since I'm already in here. <coughs> Let me get rid of Mazatub. the tub. Okay, uh, that one's in, or Erdogan, and Ribbon's Fire. Okay. Erdogan, Ribbon's Fire, let me go to my shit just up. Inventory. Let's see, there's one you give me as a, uh, no, that's the one I got was a, and you give me the alchemy. That's a damage health potion, what's the following priorities? Weapon fur and ravage tails. I have to look them up. And the one I got was a two one that's enchanters, and it is a uh, frost resist. Yep, frost resist. Flip uh, frost resist. Quality epic. Okay. Okay. <coughs> now, do, 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 do. this one use the strangeness the South Point has in me. This one is the douchebag. Okay, glyphs first here. Come out with a yeah. Uh, nope, that's not the one. Uh, maybe nope, monumental. Okay, fuck you, dude. Okay, go left for false resistance. That's grand, though. <coughs> that needs to be what was it? Uh, God damn it. It's gotta be superb. So that was green.
many of these The thrust of jelly scrap and stink horn. Stink horn, stink horn. 
Eight wood. Jelly scrap, jelly scrap. <coughs> That's the one. Okay, man. Now I can uh, go on and go to the next one. Dara's jade dragoons would throw them into the sea. None of us is come to deliver our little private contract. Okay, I mean, I got now sixty three again. Alrighty, now get the bang. I don't know, man. You know, I, w I would hope, you know, that them work out like that. Yeah. 
I know I got ready to learn. Griff that one around and them raffles dude come up to about being uh who's the best in the guild's gonna win, you know what I mean? I don't think that bullshit's done a bit for her, man. I mean seriously. Holy fuck the shit I got up on my phone. What the fuck? Which one are you, motherfucker? Oh my god. They opened this. Where you going? What is it, goddamn night, boy? you back. Hey, bae. Hey, bae. One second, here. I need you to help me out, motherfucker. One second, baby. Let daddy find his, uh... Okay. Just give me a second. Yeah, I'm not 
point over. You there? Yeah, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Okay. Okay. What you been into, baby? Not real much. Okay, sweetie. <coughs> yes, I know why. insurance is not an asset. Mm -mm. No, she don't. They're already getting his damn check. They can't make him sign it, uh, get rid of Jack shit. That's all, they can, that's all they can take from him. They're trying to fuck her over. <laughs> They're just trying to fuck her over. They already took his social security check, didn't they? Well, that's all they can take. You're crazy or no if you sign the, uh, if you sign, go to sign in the damn his life insurance policy. But what it is, they don't want to have to pay that fucking policy. And uh, by law they have to go they take it instead. Well, I tell them they got a head there, and I, 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 I'll make sure I have me a lot of you, though. They're a bar for me. They're a bar for me. Uh, to, to them. Stop it. <laughs> oh Lord, hey, I wonder if they would do that. And she's crazy, but uh, she doesn't want burden with the dad of it. Uh, there's much to uh, do about it. I wouldn't be Jack Smith, they're not going to put, they cannot legally put in all that for that. <laughs> The old, uh, no, 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 they, uh, 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 you know if you can come in and you can come out better as any man in an apartment and just paying somebody to take care of it. And he's getting better too. Well, yeah, uh, I never thought, I'll be honest, I never thought they'd put him in her. I know you can't, but you still would have come out better just going ahead and paying somebody to took care of him as had him in a nursing home. They abuse him in, in them places, man. I mean, they honestly... They, they honestly do, man. I, 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 I would have never... You let Sabrina talk you right into another bad fucking mistake, didn't you? I mean... Well, yeah, yeah. Sabrina won that. Let's just be honest about it. Yeah. Huh? Uh, no, I... Uh, yeah, I know you did, Marlena. But you just would have come out better left than him in that apartment and just going ahead and paying somebody to take care of him as putting him in her. Because he won't last long in her. <coughs> I mean, laying lay all shit aside, he won't last long in her. He, he, you know, and that's a shame, too, man. Well. And now he enters the sign and uh, over every goddamn thing uh, that, that he's got to him. Uh, and selling off everything he, uh, that he's got. 
Yeah, yeah but uh, <laughs> well, but of, but of course, uh, you know, but of course, they, they, uh, they're fucking money hungry, or hun, they're going, they'll, they'll want to suck you and dry for every goddamn thing you can get out of him, because they're a fucking business, <laughs> and, and, and they're lying, that's bullshit, he don't, uh, you know, they don't have to do that, he does not have to get rid of no life insurances or policies like that. He just has to give them his goddamn social security check. That's for taking care of him. I, I, yeah, well, I always, I, I, buddy, I never thought your mommy would go for that and throw him in one of them places. Well, uh, they were other options, more like the hell you was going to end up giving the check away anyway, so you should have just fucking uh, took the money and bought him some good care with it. I mean, you know, uh, why not just spend his money and get him some good care out of it and, and not give the fucking uh, money to a bunch of strangers? That is exactly how they're going to treat him, uh, like a stranger, like shit. Uh, well, let's be honest, we all know that they abuse old people in nursing homes and they don't take care of them like they should and they never last long in her. <coughs> yeah, I mean, uh, it's not, I, I bet, honey, that's where, that's where you go ahead and pay, pay for, uh, 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 there's plenty of home health care that, that will take care of him for, for, the, uh, for lesser money than uh, you're paying to keep him in that fucking nursing home. You can, uh, he could have paid, he could have paid his rent and, and, and everything with the money that he was getting a month, could have paid his rent and got him some decent health care and he could have stayed home and not been in order to where he, uh, they abuse him and every fucking thing else, man. Don't think they don't. And it's a shame he, he ain't even fucking 65 year old and in a fucking nursing home. Uh, there's plenty you can do. It's called take him out there for you and fucking liquidate his goddamn assets to him. To you and, uh, then you're pretty well stuck or a stuck or once you liquidate all these assets to him. Oh, they're not, no, they don't want him to get better. They want to use him for a cash cow till he fucking dies. That's exactly what they want to do. Then, uh, the, uh, then they'll make room for the next old one that comes along that their, that their family don't want to deal with them. I know that, Beth, that's where you, uh, <coughs> Dude, I ain't doing no you motherfucker. I got things to do. That's, that's where you go ahead and and and, and, and pay to have it done, they. Uh, uh, you pay somebody to come in to do it, just like Sandy did with Kathleen, and, and then all the burden ain't on you, and 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 all that, man. I mean, you know, I I don't agree with putting people in, in in places they never last long once they're put in or I can tell you what right now put try to put me in one when I get older and I, and I just go ahead and bust the cap on myself because it ain't no worse uh, death couldn't be worse for that fucking place which <coughs> I, I mean seriously death couldn't be no worse than being put in one of those places I know, I know there ain't nobody gonna put me in one. I mean, I'm just saying, I, I just don't agree with that. My mommy wasn't put in one, my daddy wasn't put in one. And, and, and uh, I just... Well, uh, uh, Sabrina's a cold-hearted bitch is what Sabrina is. I don't care about nobody but her fucking self. And the one, and the one that he, uh, 
Hey, hey, yeah, well, that's what I was going to say. He really should have thought about that his own goddamn self where he put the one that could have given less of that thing he'd fuck for him over him. He know Marlena was the one that was always going to stick by him and, and, and be there for him. And he he done, done the one that didn't give a shit for nothing but the money. And, and now it ain't even the money with her of it. She just don't want the fucking nuisance of it. And let's just be honest. Or she wouldn't me she wouldn't be down there at a hobby signing uh, signing the bullshit away the same way she did with Paulette to leave it off on Marlena. I think she's crazy in hell if she signs him a goddamn thing. And to be honest, I, I would fight to take him out of her and I, I'd put him in an apartment or something and, and just uh, take his money and put it toward him some good health care to, to where he'll be around a while instead of fucking uh, being uh, uh, abused is exactly what I'd do. And let's, <laughs> let's be honest, I'm, I'm not all that fond in the world of him, but I still wouldn't do him that fucking way. <laughs> Me and him's had her ups and downs, but I, but goddamn, I wouldn't do him like that. I wouldn't, I wouldn't do a fucking stranger like that. Man, I, I've been in them places. I've seen how they treat them people, the elderly. It's, it's a shame. Uh, there's some of, uh, some of the people works are all good to them, and then there's some of the people were that don't give a fuck that treat them like shit. <coughs> I mean. That's, but that's not in my uh, decisions or opinion. Uh, I can state a, I can state an opinion that that's the best I can do. So that's not, that's not doing. You know what I mean? It's, you know, it's it's not uh, it's not not uh, not, not my mom or daddy, man. God bless you. Stay me down. Well, uh, that ain't you. I don't know. I, I don't want it. It, it, It's a fucking shame. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's pretty many. And I said that. There's no doubt about it. I didn't know that didn't work. I put my money in that he put in once. You look what Tina, uh, Tina did to take care of mommy. She took him for the whole life, I know, to take care of mommy. And actually, she ever regretted it. And I was going to tell you, she said, hey, you fuck no, she did. Uh, uh, I mean, seriously. Uh, George didn't raise Sabrina, and From Sabrina don't give a fuck. Sugar Jill, I summon Vanguard Hill. He raised your mommy uh, to her, she'll always hold a grudge. But they raised Marlena and not, and not her. And the way they see a fucking admit that it wasn't that good, it's a fact. Ten anchors drop for each that is destroyed. I mean, seriously. I, 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 I guess I mean, you, you don't have to be and stuff as to where you really understand uh, and we were, we were really both of us were there for you and it was different when it comes to Sabrina <coughs> exactly and, 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 and it wasn't like that uh, uh, she was raised by a hell of a woman that's a fact but uh, she she just don't give a shit for George, and that uh, and uh, uh, so and you, nobody can fucking make it. And uh, regardless, and at the end of the day, Beth, he's still your papa. Yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd hope he is. I don't know, Paulette always said your mommy was Ed Burry's, but that's side the point. <coughs> I don't do it, goddamn.
How you getting old and seen Al, damn it? He knows better than that. Now, I tell you, it does more, Lena, like because you don't want to fucking leave him there. I, I don't honestly say it does kill you to go see him in a place like that. I, I can fucking tell you he does. I, and, and I'd say they're fucking abusing him too. Because let's be honest, he's a perv anyway. So, you know, uh, you can bet them nurses is meaner and shit to him. They might act like they're all goody goody to your face, but you're not there 24 7 to see how the fuck they treat him. I mean. <coughs> Uh, George always was a womanizer, so, you know. <clears throat> well, it's the truth, but that don't make him uh, no lesser to be treated uh, the way they treat people. Uh, fuck, hell, Donald Trump's a goddamn womanizer, that motherfucker, you know what I mean? I don't know, I, I wouldn't leave him or anything. Ain't no damn way. What about the, uh, what's her name? She used to be crazy over him. I guarantee you, she you you you, you have to just make it uh, to where uh, she, she could just take care of him, and she would stay with him and take care of him. That one or uh, that bipolar one might have to worry about her knifing him, but. <coughs> Oh, did she? Now you're done. She finally gave up on him and moved down. <coughs> yeah, I don't know, babe. <coughs> So, let me ask you, do you think you could have nasty sex and still go to heaven? That's my question. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I said, do you think that you could have nasty sex and still go to heaven? And I mean nasty shit, I don't mean no, just... Never got the nasty uh, leather to that one. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, don't judge me, girl. Daddy needs love, too. I it ain't fucking working, so you get worse. Don't judge me, Elizabeth. <laughs> Shit, I saw you on YouTube looking for a while at her Vaseline and said. Yeah, I figured you did. Okay, is that me? Does that make you think any less or at me? Well, okay, we're good, man. <laughs> yeah, did he? Yeah. You know, like half them little angry masturbators you run up on her and then and then lobbies are sitting there going, mm, mm, mm. All that shit there, man, you know they're just sitting there watching porn of her beating herself to death or Vaseline and sin all up in there. Yeah, I guess, you know. <laughs> I know. I don't know. I don't know, I just think it'd be kind of cool to run up on a woman that could agree to that. <laughs> I'm just saying.
Well, that's ninety percent of the population, mate. Okay, we're. Well, yeah, yeah, you're a cut above, girl. That's exactly right. That's right. Now you raised right. I have to admit. Look at your mommy. She's one of them Vaseline and sand smellers. I'm just saying. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. See, I'm not trying to cut her. I'm just being honest. Yeah, I'm just being truthful. She's a kinky old bitch. Don't ever doubt it. I would. <laughs> What <laughs> you spraying on your feet, babe? Now, Lord, is you? At uh, 1.37. <coughs> they still got her on the night shift. Still get your weekends off, though, don't you? You know I'd like to, see, you know I'd like to see you. I'm just going to throw that out there. Been over, over, yeah, been over a year. I'd, I'd like to, I'd like to at least spend some time with you. You know. Yeah, I know summer's coming up. That's Will you? That'd be cool. I like that. Come spend a bit with me. I'm gonna build. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna build me a computer. I, I figured I'd give you mine. Not that there's anything wrong with it. Do you? That's good. But what I'm wanting is I just come out a little bit cheaper to build it. Does he? Yeah, that's what I'm wanting. <coughs> you know me. Uh, yeah. I've, I've watched a few videos on them. It's no more than what I did to mod. Can, uh, consoles and shit. Yeah, I know. I've seen them pictures you posted. I mean, I figured you'd been busy. Met this one, met this one girl in Kentucky. Huh? And, uh, yeah. When she, that yeah, wasn't going, yeah, it was going all right to her first or till, uh, She's one of them uh, swinger and bangers, her, and uh, I'm too old to play them games. No, she a different, different kind of swinger. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, one of those. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it didn't work out too good, but. Yeah, you know me. Uh, the benefits really don't mean that much at night. I'm just saying. You get a gift. Yeah, yeah. You get a gift. Then the floor looks good from yesterday, the one you sent me. I'll go to you, though. No, 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 
dead and filled up, no one can hear you, that's why I brought you up. <laughs> My friends, you may have the world, is that what you got? No. <laughs> Where has the giant yeah. gone? No. Back to milk some mammoth. Mm. Yeah, you, you don't want to hear you. You don't want to hear you close to the ground, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Your strength will be rewarded. Oh, oh God. Okay. Uh, no, nobody can hear you, babe. You know, maybe you like that. You're not going to tell me you have me right now. You're going to know where I'm back, babe, okay? Yeah, well, you know what? You know what, baby? You're down and over now, and Kyle Harper is just a fuck with him. <laughs> Nah, nah, it just lost its, uh, uh, it just lost its allure to it there, man. You can just fuck with a hooker so much. I mean, then they get all needy and shit and start calling back because business must be down for him or something because, you know, and I'm saying for $200, they better, yeah, I ain't even gonna say it. <laughs> Man, yeah, they better be doing some shit I ain't never done, and I've done a lot of shit in my life, so. <laughs> See, your mommy is one of them that does shit you ain't never done. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're a whore, huh? <laughs> Oh, oh, there you go. <laughs> you can't hear me. That's good. That's... Oh, okay. Yeah, as long as she can't hear me, that's good. Yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. No, we haven't. We honestly haven't, but I admit, you honestly have us. I think about you every day, but I, you know, I know you, you're busy and shit, honey. You know daddy loves you. Huh? Uh, say what? Oh. I was just talking about balking the shit out old Goofy or... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, God. Don't beat on her, babe. You know you fucking three heads taller and got about 50 pounds on her bony ass. Hello? Hey, what, she fattened up? She looked like a Oompa Loompa? <laughs> really? Yeah, hello. Yeah, you ain't gonna get that, Tubby. That'll starve itself to death before that happens. She always did the right shit. You know, every time she ever get a little bit of weight on her and start looking halfway decent, not like a Ethiopian, she'd fucking gag herself to death. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she will. She's got one of them uh, bony bitch com complexion stir. Man, well, whatever you want to call it. <coughs> well, she used to be a little porkish her when she was an entertained her, and it didn't, yeah, it didn't last long. She did. <coughs> yeah, that's uh, that's where you get been sick from. It ain't from my bony ass, that's for sure. No, 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 I was thick, thick like you, you know, not, not, yeah, not, you're, you're just thick, baby, you're, yeah, no, you're not fat, you're just thick, yeah, most, most men prefer a thick woman to be honest, you know.
<laughs> we know you're not scared of me, girl. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, like that time you told me, you don't feed me. I started losing weight during the CPS. I call it the CPS against you. That's funny shit, man. I thought, damn, you could miss a hundred mils and you'd be okay. <laughs> Oh shit, man. We've had good times. I know. We had always had good times. We had rough times, but we had good times. I mean, um, um, yeah, you know, we are. <laughs> I really got into, uh, 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 goddamn King of Winter, really shit, wrong one. Uh, got in them Games of Thrones real good. Yeah, yeah, I got past since this Dylan's of it, and it's, well, it don't completely, I'll, uh, uh, I think Khaleesi will. Well, Jon Snow ends up being, uh, more than just a bastard, <laughs> you know. No, well, I know. I, I've done. I've done went through them once and going through them again because you know, Daddy, he falls asleep during shit. Yeah, I've watched them. Yeah. Yeah, I've watched all uh, all seven uh, seasons of it, and uh, you know me how I. Uh, uh, well, no one yet. It's still a uh, what's her name or a queen bitch. For the moment, she is pretty. You know, she's in three uh, three hundred. Yeah, yeah, she is. Uh, the, Got uh, a resto staff during hound. Oh, did you? Did you get a retro staff, her dude? Yeah. Uh, yeah, and I, I, yeah, old John Snows was going to be a big player in it. As a bit. See, he gives his sword to Khaleesi. Mm hmm. Yeah, he gives his sword to her. Yeah. Uh, I got HBO now, but if you want to, uh, you'll have to download it on a device so to watch it, but you can watch them. Norman Hound. Norman Hound? Yeah, I will send it to you. And, uh, you can, uh, yeah, download that and watch it, dude, because I'm telling you, it's good. I mean, it's really good. I'll have to get on her to, uh, to get the log in and shit for you. But, uh, I will. I will. I I'll send it to you today, you know what. But, uh, yeah, you'll be surprised. I won't tell you about it. Unless you watch them. <laughs> no, well, well, it, 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 uh, it's just a couple times on that deal. The, uh, Hell yeah, I'm going to keep it, you know, the best blah blah blah. Yeah, I don't mind you, dude. I'd be a good one, too. Uh, yeah, Dan says, after the first season of it, it's, it's not so bad. It comes back into play about the fourth season, but after that, yeah, they capture him and shit there, so. <coughs> Oh, back in them days, they married uh, cousins to, to keep the, uh, they, uh, to them, I was keeping the bloodline pure, but I, I just, yep, <coughs> whatever you want to call it, ain't it, yeah, nasty ass shit, you know, which, uh, whatever, I won, uh, I won shit I was watching, it, I, I, it was about like that, about, uh, uh, when it come to that. Yeah, about about the bullshit there, you know. That to me, that's just sick shit. But Tina kept telling me it was good if I just get past that, that uh, I'd like it. Which she was right. Yeah, she, she kept telling me it was good. Where I like mo uh, movies and sh uh, shows like that, but dragons, <laughs> dragons, and uh, yeah. Mm. Basically, something like that, ain't it? Yeah, 
Yeah, but Lord of the Rings don't go medieval damn interesting though, man. I mean, <laughs> you know, I like the, the Hobbit kind of better than Lord of the Rings, which I know it played off of it, but I like the Hobbit a little bit better than Lord of the Rings itself. <coughs> I think that that uh, that was that incest and shit, shit, dude. That's just uh, some sick ass shit. You know what I mean? That's uh, that, yeah, but I guess in a way it makes for an interesting build because of you know how how they are hiding it and all that shit. To see how they was gonna keep getting by with it without getting caught up in it, which as it is, everybody knows it any damn way. They just wasn't being straight out. Yeah. How 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 much of them have you watched? Oh oh Lord, you quit watching it. It just really got good then. Yeah, because it, it really gets a lot better out there. I can tell you what, right now, old John Snow's not a bastard. He's not, uh, he's not, he's not a bastard. No, no, uh, Snow's is a pretty bastard, John. Uh, he's not a bastard. Boy, uh, believe it or not, he's a, uh, <laughs> he's a real big old bug. Old John Snow is. Uh huh. Yes, he is. Uh, but uh, you, 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 you can watch it for yourself. Here, I'm mean, gonna run it for you. You know. Oh, you got another. Oh, you got another master with those staff hats. I need one of them, baby. And a lot, man. I got the the asylum. No, I got this other night, baby. When I was a playing asylum, I meant to I meant to show you. Oh, I'm playing. Uh, you know what I'm playing? What I always play. I got. Yeah, I got this one the other night there. Yeah, me. Uh, I got the chat thing here. Uh, I got this one, dude. I was pretty happy about that. I, I completed my set there, man. I got to change the trade on it. But. <coughs> what you doing outside, mate? Yeah. Mm. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah it is. It was hotter than hell. I only got the other conditions on, to be honest, you know. I you see I'm um, beat on them, you know, and it's hot. It's fucking hot yesterday. How hot is it out right now? It's pretty hot. That's uh, why it's too damn hot. You tell it is. I mean, honestly, man. Then another one in my life. Short playing. I found another one in there, I'm not still playing, I don't know if I got time for it though. That's her. Mm -hmm. thing seems to play something like this, but kind of different, you know. So I don't, it's basically about the same. I don't think the, uh, <coughs> the, uh, 
the graphics are great. I mean, really great. And the way you can customize your characters are really great. But, I mean, with some of the action, yeah, yeah. I think like uh, ESA, uh, they say they think that it was better than the ESA characters. It may be kind of a little, but uh, to me, the, the gameplay of it, a little, well, kind of a lot of shit, yeah, you know, if you want to be honest about it. But, uh, uh, kind of slow, real slow pace. Yeah, I downloaded it and tried it uh, a little bit this morning, but I'm undecided. No, I didn't stream it. I'm still undecided whether I'm wanting to just uh, time into it like that because I know it takes so much fucking time anyway. I mean, you know, honestly, they take so much time, and it's hard to want to take on another game to play, being like it is, you know. And it a, in, what, a month and a half, another DLC comes out for this, and it's going to be another great one. And, yeah, it's going to be a great one. Another game changer. <coughs> it's about the Hales. It'll be about Isles, but it had some new uh, skill lines and stuff like that in it. So, going to be, uh, like I said, uh, yeah, going to be, you'll be able to craft jewelry and, uh, uh, yeah, I know what, and that's something we can't do right now. So, you know, it's going to be a real game changer, you know. Turn, uh, it, it, it is, I mean, you know, honestly, it, it's a real game changer for the game considering that, you know, right now, that's the one thing you can't make in crafted sets is jewelry. And, uh, you know, and you're not only going to be able to craft it, you're going to be able to upgrade jewelry if you pick up, too. So, you know, like where I've been so long right now running in one trials trying to get a necklace I've been wanting to complete this uh, sort of plan on... Uh, I can use the one I already got and uh, stop the drive on it, you know what I mean? So, you just rank them to 65 and then uh, on, that, on that one, I, I'm telling you about, but I mean, they got another one and they, and it, it, to me it just looks like the, the feel that this one has, I mean, you know, uh, I'm going to give it a chance. And, that's what I was going to say. I'm going to give it a chance to play it a little bit, but I don't think I can get a good book to put it. No, well, true, true. You know, I... I well, very true there. I, I, oh, Lord, uh, it'd take a hell of a game to beat until done for the graphics. I mean, you know, and the graphics in the, in the uh, Terra are great, too. I mean... Um, <clears throat> but it to me it just seems like it's a, a pay to win deal after you get to 65 it's, to me it seems like it's a pay to win and you know I, how I am when it's uh, I'm about pay to win uh, but it's more of an honest character put in there instead of it being an equal deal that everybody can get it no matter whether they're uh, uh, how much cash they spend or at uh, of that bill, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's a pay to win. About like what they made uh, uh, massacre to be on their last go. I mean, you know, cause, let's face it. Yeah, yeah, Mass Effect is definitely a, a pay to win. And, uh, uh, I mean, uh, nice to be able to buy some stuff, but when, when uh, the best shit in the game is to be bought, you know what I mean, that's, uh, that's a pay to win, you know. I mean, honestly, you know, and pay to win just me off because not that, you know, you know me, uh, it is a, it, it's not a level playing ground, and I, I don't like the level playing ground, you know. Not that, uh, because, you know, some people just 
spend and spend money on them like we can and uh, when it comes to that and uh, I don't see it being a fair deal. Sure, mounts and shit like that, you know, putting money in there. How about another house? You know that, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I yeah, do. Yeah, I Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. But, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm just totally against things like that. You know, I can honestly say that, um... Nope. I ain't played no PUBG lately. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm needing those and wanting those. I'm going to go to PC, babe. Um, you know, not to lie, I'm going to go to PC because uh, uh, there's a lot of things for us and there's some downsides. You know, I'm not going to quit my console play. But I'm gonna go PC. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, but uh, uh, to be honest, uh, I think it's just more to have the, uh, some, yep. Um, I think it's more to just, uh, to, in my case, just to spend some more money on shit I don't need. <laughs> oh shit, I'll just be honest, I'm a, I'm a damn computer dude. I mean, yeah, you know I am my old bad boy. You know. but not that I'll probably play that much on one of it, because I do love my consoles. It's hard to beat consoles. I mean, you know, it honestly is. But I am trying to build my perspective more. <laughs> I think we all can build my perspective. And, uh, what, how long have I had? Yeah, how long have I used this PC here on that Elgato when I'm not melted it down? So. That says a lot for that PC, but I know if I would go to playing games on it at the rate I want to play them, I would burn it down, and it's just too good a computer to burn it down, you know what I mean? Not the way I do it, and the only time I use Elgato now is when I play Xbox, so, you know. Which they... These sixties are a fortune anyway, but I mean you could buy the console for what I get for the HD sixty when I bought it because when I bought it was well, well, you know uh, we was talking about that the other day. You know you can't uh, a budget build is uh, around five hundred dollars on a build on a on a computer, and you cannot build on a budget build uh, 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 a PC that can write to a console. I mean, they, they, they might try to put it off of it, but you can't. I mean, it's just not doable. I mean, not for, not to be able to stream and, uh, and, and that stuff. There's no way it's not doable, you know. Um, that's the beauty part about the PCs, you don't have to pay the monthly subscription, but you know me, I pay mine yearly anyway, so it's not that big a deal to me about it. I think, and uh, like, you pay for what you get in a lot of matters when it comes to that stuff. But, I don't know, you know how I am, I'm, I'm up for anything. Then I can honestly say it, you know, I, I game on all three platforms, which that's something I have been wanting to do, you know. I could, as it is, with, like I said, with the PC I got, because it wasn't cheap, it was far from it, but uh, I just figure the way I do and what I am, I'd melt it down, and it's just, to me, it's kind of time for a new PC after 
Oh, let's be honest, the year's a long life for a PC for me. I mean, I mean, being straight up and honest, the year is a kind of a long life for a PC for me. Because, I mean, I burned shit down. I, uh, not just PC consoles, too. I go through a lot of consoles. And, I mean, I got over, what, about four, it wasn't, I've had to go buy other, <coughs> I got about four grand in my setup as it is, and that's not current account in the consoles, and, um, I mean, seriously, but, and a lot of people can't afford to put that much into shit, and I'm not going to keep on, on a PC to, I just think I can get a, be a better machine to build it. But for what I give, you know, to the uh, to someone to build it, I can take that mo that money too and put in the build, and uh, you know, it's gonna be a hell of a machine. <coughs> but I still do have the one I have, and I figured that I would, uh, where I do have so much into it, I'd give that one to you. Cause you're my base. <laughs> And it is totally gameable, one, and I figured I'd get you into doing that with me. <laughs> we just do that together. And then you don't have to worry about a monthly subscription or not like I wouldn't pay it for you anyway. Can't get you back in the game room with me, buddy. I know, I know, sweetheart. Well, well, well yes. Well. Right now, it's, there's, I was going to buy you another account, so it, there's, right now, but it's so close to them changing off platforms again. I used to buy you one, then turn right around and have to buy you another one. I know that sucks big time, you know. Uh, I, I seen a PS4 the other day, and I thought, I believe I'll go ahead and buy it for Bay, and then I got, you know, um, and uh, now they're, everybody's talking about that it, uh, yeah, we're close. They're thinking it can be even as close as, uh, as this year, at the end of the year, you know, around Christmas, if they do it again. You know, they're, they're really not, nobody's really coming out and telling and stuff of how close we are of it. And it, so unassuming. An the Xbox order, is, has, has come out with a, with the one, and, and to be honest, I'm kind of scared of buying PlayStation one. 5 is coming out 2020. Yeah, I know we're close, Alex, for the, for the new PS5. And I don't want to have to turn right around and buy more consoles, uh, and, uh, after just buying consoles, you know what I mean? <coughs> it's, um, Bill, I do well, sweetheart. No, there you think she's talking to her, Marlena Don. She, oh God, Miranda. PlayStation 5 release date is at 2019 December. I don't know what day yet. Yeah, it's, I figure it'd be in December too, Alex, uh, about about that time because uh, <coughs> uh, they're going to have to release something to come up to match the, the Xbox One, which, and then there you go, Xbox is going to try to come out with another console and it's a it's a fucking console war, man. I mean, seriously, these console wars are hard on the consumers, man. Because you know, we all try to stay up to date and stuff, man. And uh, it uh, why are we? I heard the Ordon really kind of uh, unfair to us, but puts money in their pockets, which. They'll tell you, they take a loss on the consoles anyway, because they know they're going to make it back through games and subscriptions, you know. 
so they take a they take really the consoles can't be uh, they're really not making that much on the console itself as like people would really like to think because even the xbox takes losses on the console because of uh, they make it back through the subscription and uh the uh the games you know and but damn, they're, they're getting to the releasing a lot quicker on us than they normally, you know. If you want to go by life, 2020 will be the, uh, the is about the right, expan uh, the, the life of the come, so. <coughs> Which, where it's, a paid where it's a paid play on the PS4, I don't think they'll take those offline, period. Uh, PlayStation's good about that. They won't jerk consoles offline. The Xbox will, and you know we're around on that date that the 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 the, uh, the, the, uh, the three sixties are uh, are coming offline. They will be took offline. The three sixties. That, that's done been and done been said. That, you know that the three sixties will be took off because they're riddled with modders. Yeah, yeah, because they're the, they're in the same situation that that, that the first Xbox was in. They're riddled with modders, and uh, they just don't want to deal with them. That's why we ended up getting the Xbox One and the PS4 was to try to get rid of uh, ninety percent of the modders, you know. Um, I mean, you know, seriously, that's why they were. Uh, <clears throat> That's why we ended up with the new, uh, the newer versions, uh, which everybody kind of got Saudi and pissy about them, but was really a good thing. They did slow a lot down, which you still have them, and yeah, I guess you always will, but, you know. I, I, don't, I don't care what they do and how they try to do it. PCs or consoles, there's always going to be modders. There's always going to be somebody to figure out uh, exploit or whatever to uh, to a game or a gaming system. It's just it's easier to do it on computers. I mean, you know, let's be honest, computers the easiest one to do it on because there's just so much out there for them. So they get they get the bad name for modders and and that stuff as to where uh, the consoles have honestly slowed down a lot for the modern, but you still have it, you know, so. <coughs> and that's on both consoles, that's not just naming one console, that's done on both, both platforms, you know, Xbox and uh, PlayStation. I think, in, 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 in truth, that's just something we all will have to deal with. It. You know, it's, you're, you're never going to get to where there's not modders on, on something because there's people that will put thousands. Yeah, yeah, there's a, there's always somebody that will go the extra mile that will put thousands of dollars into something just to get a, a little bit of an edge, you know. I mean, cheating's cheating, straight up, and modern is one of the, uh, but uh, a lot of condone it, man, I mean, a lot of gamers condone it, and I honestly don't condone modern, or exploit, or anything of, of that nature myself. Um, if, if it's to get something you know, that's going to be beneficial in, in a way without hurting someone else, I say go for it, but uh, I mean, honestly, because you're not hurting nobody. I like the mods on Fallout 4 and stuff like that. I don't see a thing in the world wrong with them, and, it, and it's good that the consoles finally did get to use them, but uh, 
when it can be carried over to, to a PVP or uh, something like that. Uh, uh, it's uh, it's it's wrong because a, a lot of people do like to play on a level playing ground and don't want to uh, don't want to uh, to do that, you know. And, and it, uh, you do see a lot of uh, of uh, PC gamers that do uh, a big PC gamers too, mind you, uh, that uh, are using. Uh, mods and stuff, uh, you know, aim bots and uh, shit like that, and, um, but it just takes one person to uh, make anything look bad. I always try to go to the, uh, the PC, my, my own self just of the, um, of the uh, true idea that I was going to have to deal with a lot of modders, because, you know, YouTube's riddled with uh, videos of people modding on PC. I mean, you know, especially in the Call of Duties and the, uh, but now that I'm, I'm really into games like this like I am, uh, it's a totally different world and PC is a good, uh, is one of the best options to play a MMO, or RPG MMO. I mean, <coughs> Yeah, you tell everybody I got too bad or not be screaming at you. I wasn't with a lady, but I'd slap a bitch. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing both, you know that. Yeah, well, I know you're not, but that's... She's going on me, Bill Weather. That's my girl. I don't know. It would be way you in. You got to Honey, it's just that time of the year. It's the CBs. Yeah, it's the CBs. Yeah, hey, good, baby. It's that time of the year. It's the CBs, baby. Hey, dude, 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 I hey, don't kill you, bitch. I'm gonna go with you. I tell you, wait, shit, bitch. That's how we go. I don't know. But, yeah, I'm going to have to make the move on that, bill. I'm not... I, at the time, I update on the PC, so... I'm, I'm absolutely uh, building me one. So. But like I said, it's not like I, I plan on just PC on the next. Because for one thing, I got too much time and money invested in this game to ever do that. I mean, seriously. I've got way too much time and money in this game to ever do that. I mean, and that's being honest, you know. Uh, dude, uh, it's, it's another genre of game, so I, I would like to try, but I pretty well just PC games. So, uh, like, uh, I always do like World of Warcraft, and, uh, uh, and uh, that, uh, that to me uh, is going to be one that's not going to be carried over to uh, uh, the console. I don't see that game playing in the console. And look at the life of that game, man. I mean, really, I, uh, when it comes to games, that game there is one that uh, a lot of uh, them and those are standards are set from, you know, seriously. A lot of standards come from that game, uh, just to, uh, well, and the ESO for that matter, I, th I think it's a cut above when it comes to uh, MMO, I mean, you know, really. Uh, 
yes, I was uh, as a fine example of 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 uh, set of bubbling and for damn because um I and, and you expect a lot from uh ESO, you know. I mean for the mechanics, the graphics and stuff, uh, the graphics probably yeah, uh, maybe be a little better, but you know. Um I think all that just comes in time, you know, to be honest. Because the game is really, for the life of the MMO, is just getting started, you know. I, I, like with that car, I find the, uh, I find the graphics great. I mean, really great, uh, graphic-wise. The uh, graphics on the game is great, I mean, seriously. But, uh, mechanics are slow at times, and, uh, but I am going to give it a chance, man, uh, to be honest, uh, and I, uh, the play style of it, I didn't think it's something I could enjoy playing, and, uh, if the, if the ranking of it is not overwhelmingly time to play, like Diablo, man, I thought that was, it would be a great game. And uh, and bought it and uh, played it some. I probably didn't have to give it all the chance it did because I'm forced and done playing it. As uh, it's hard to go off to a game and play when you have something like this to play. I mean, you know, let's be honest. Uh, which uh, another thing about the turret deal is, uh, I, you know, it is an MMO. And I'm finding myself to, to like it. MMOs a hell of a lot more than what I do. Uh, okay, baby. That is it. Bye, baby. If you took the bad Alex her, um, it's free to play, uh, which if you want to get down basically to it. Elder Scroll is, for that matter, you don't have to take the uh, subscription. I mean, seriously, you don't have to. You can enjoy the game. You can make, get max rank without, <coughs> uh, without spending a penny on the game, but the base price, you know, so... It's, it's not the free play deal of it. It has a subscription. I, I'm just holding back to buy that to see if it's a game I want to spend that kind of time and cash into. Uh, Burn, motherfucker. I, I mean, uh, I, I, I'm, once I make it past uh, the uh, basic stage of it and uh, you go on to the um, other parts of it, if, uh, uh, I'm just holding my opinion back on it at the moment, to be honest, because uh, I've, I've not, I just started at it, uh, I picked the sorcerer, uh, maybe not uh, a, a good class to pick, but, uh, you know, I picked the sorcerer because of my play style, I, I'm feeling, but which I'll try more of them. Uh, just to give it a fair chance, because a lot of people will start this and think the ranking on it is so big and grand and and <coughs> which is, you know, to be honest, which honestly is, and, and you, you got to put a lot of time and effort in this game. But you do get to a point that you know things come to you easier, dungeons come easier, uh, PvP, PvP. I, I think you can honestly uh, rank that when it comes to any game, MMO or, or a multiplayer shooter or whatever. I think PvP is just what it is. PvP. They, uh, um, I mean, honestly, uh, when it comes to anything, PvP is PvP. 
regardless of uh, <coughs> of the game, you know, and. Uh, And if it's something, to be honest about it, is that going to take more into my gameplay with this game? I, I would think that that's going to be something I'm not going to, uh, to, uh, stick with. Because, uh, I'm, to me, it's hard to find a better MMO than what I'm playing. It, it was, uh, I mean, you know. And a lot of people that don't play uh, ESO that are playing that game, uh, to me, really didn't give ESO that good a chance because the game is set pretty well. Like ESO in, in, in numerous ways. <coughs> I mean, seriously, in, in, in uh, numerous ways, the game is set like ESO. So you're I mean, so, you know. I mean, straight up being honest, the game is really set like a ESO, but uh, it don't have the ESO feel to it. And uh, um, and uh, a little trouble to me that it don't have the ESO feel to it because my uh, World of Warcraft has the ESO feel to it. I mean, really, uh, because uh, that was kind of some of my. Uh, uh, direction that I ended up going with it. I, uh, like my daughter said, uh, uh, a year ago, two years ago, I would, uh, would have honestly, uh, told you no when it comes to this game. I would say you would not have, uh, seen me on this game. Uh, and, and it's, Honestly, to end up having as many tunes as I have, they've been no way because I, I would have, uh, 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 to me, uh, 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 MMOs were, uh, overrated, I felt. Uh, but they, uh, and then after uh, really throwing a judgment out without, uh, without, without honestly playing to, uh, you know, uh, without honestly playing the game and giving a judgment beforehand, you know, to be honest, that was a, a, just a, uh, an opinion that we, uh, I would honestly have to retract because, uh, like I said, God damn everybody will end that up this bed, don't they? He negate him or they did negate him. Uh, I mean, I, if you can't admit where you were wrong and shit, kind of going on you, but on the same end, you know, like I said, uh, at the time, I was full fledged shooter, but I had played the Fallout and I did play uh, uh, Skyrim. And Skyrim had a lot of influence that I ended up playing this, to be honest, because uh, I, I honestly think if it wasn't for playing Skyrim, and uh, uh, probably wouldn't have sort of played the game. And, and my nephew kept on coming in, kept coming. What a great game it was, and uh, with uh, different play styles, but he liked medieval games. I was, I liked the, the medieval evil feel of games, uh, but some of them, uh, let's be honest, some games, uh, the mechanics of them are totally shitty, and uh, uh, hard to. Uh, and this game, the mechanics are great. I'm, I mean, seriously. Ooh, shit. Uh, I, I mean... This game, the mechanics are great. The graphics are good. Uh, not the best in some RPGs, but they are really good. Uh, the game overall plays smooth, uh, you know. 
mean, there's a, over all this game, that play really smooth. Uh, it's been, it's a mega service, and, uh, you suck a nip. There a bit. There. Take it, motherfucker. Take it. Oh, it's still. Come on, bitch. Glad he did. Get in that. Get in the hope. Okay, there we go. But, I mean, overall, <coughs> people can hate on it or love ESO. Uh, some of them say, uh, I think on ESO, to be honest, Tura doesn't have the, uh, uh, the options of your character creation. Nothing like ESO, man. They're all kind of preset, and you have to go from a preset boundary and uh, merge it. Yeah, I got to merge it. Um, um, so, uh, And, and, damn, I gotta cut that fucking air conditioner off, dude. My, my feet's fucking ice cold, dude. That's one thing I say, dude. I got a hell of air conditioning in this place, man. But, uh. We are getting a hurricane. Oh, shit. Really? Oh, God, man. That's why the weather's ended up warming up so much. I hate this time of the year. Uh, it's, spring's really nice, but. The weather, dude, is so unpredictable and so many hurricanes and shit, man. I mean, hurricanes, oh, shit. I mean, have you, have you checked into it, yes. uh, Alex? Have you looked into it? Uh, I, I've had two or three of my friends mention it and thought, eh, another MMO, I kind of don't want to take one on right now. And to be honest, I honestly don't want to take another one on at the moment. But, that being said, uh, kind of being <coughs> a little, uh, dude, Lynch, 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 do, 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 under Magica, and Mex Magica, and all that good shit, Leviathan. Uh, medium sturdy, and eh, probably break it down just for the shit. Uh, Evan Graves don't really need them. Let's see. Leviathan. I believe I keep the jewelry. Uh, I guess these guys want to go ahead and do all the daily. The hurricane is in Georgia heading this way where I live at. Damn, going up the coast, huh? Up the east coast, towards you. You live, I know where you live. You've told me where you live before. Damn, dude, I hate that. <coughs> well, if it's coming towards you, that's going, that's going to come through my area too, dude, I guess. You know, basically, you know, it's going to be coming through me on me too. Um. Which we have mountains, dude, you know, that pretty well, we end up flooding on hurricanes. Uh, we don't kind of get ravaged like you guys do about the hurricanes. Live in Boston. Yeah, yeah I mean, I thought you said you lived in Boston. And uh, where I live in West Virginia, unless it just basically stays on the coastline, it, it'll hit us too. But if it's in Georgia, it Be here Sunday. Be here Sunday, damn, dude, I hate to, or, you know, I'd be a batman down the hatches, man, I mean, and for God's sake, dude, if it looks bad for you, dude, leave that place, man, you know what I mean? I got a, uh, I got a cousin, uh, he lives in, uh, in, uh, St. Petersburg, Florida, in Clearwater, and, uh, Every time a hurricane hits and do down, I worry about her. I mean, I honestly do that. Uh, <coughs> I mean, straight up, I worry about her, man, because um, Uh, 
Nothing, nothing like fire water to ravage, you know what I mean? And normally, dude, everything's uh, uh, is, is just the beginning of bad shit because they end up being fire. Uh, a lot of places will can't take the rain. They go to breaking down, then they end up catching on fire and uh, just shit in general gets bad, dude. I mean, you know. Uh, but with us, it's flooding, man. I mean, and I don't know if you've ever went through a flood, but oh my God, dude, flooding is, is, is it's devastating. Uh, I've went through quite a few, dude, and uh, which, like I've said before, I'm, I'm pretty lucky of where I live because uh, it, it's uh, it floods, but I mean, I'm, I'm in a position that. Uh, not so bad. I mean, all in all, it's really not so bad because uh, we can work, uh, we're in, uh, like I said, a decent position geographically that uh, basically we just sit back and watch the damn devastation instead of uh, having to, uh, I mean, you know. I, I've seen it so bad, it, it, it's been up in the yard, and uh, trust me, when it gets in my yard, it, it's pretty damn bad. I mean, just no shit. I really, uh, the, uh, the, like, uh, like in poor people in, in uh, Louisiana, back a few years back, uh, and, and things like when shit like that happens, dude, the worst then people come out, you know. Instead of pulling together and uh, being uh, a community helping each other, some one of rob and loot and rape for that matter, you know. That's bad and sad, man, I mean, seriously. It's only sad, bad, and sad. It uh, <coughs> is another it. storm in Dallas right now. Is happening. Oh God, in Dallas. Yeah, the weather. Uh, yeah, goddamn, it's got a spine, friend. It's got that spine. There's something not dead here. Uh, weather, but it, I know everybody tries to put it off on global warming and shit, Alex. But if you go back to the history of of man uh, of mankind, we have this shit, man. And, and every few decades and stuff in in history, you'll see you'll see this shit. Though I mean, it's sad but true, you know, and. Uh, Done yet. Yeah, there we go. Good. Uh, one of them done the goddamn mission in here and just couldn't the trigger it. Uh, God, man, I, I mean, seriously, but it is hard to beat 16 fucking K casters, man. I mean, honestly. That ended up being a little better than I fucking thought it'd be, dude. I thought it. When I first got out here, it just going to be a mediocre staff about like everything else, man. And uh, just ain't the case with it, dude. I mean, seriously. But, don't get me wrong, man. I, uh, oh, this is good stuff. Old Selos must have been raking in a fortune. Eventually, we are going to deplete our, re our natural resources. So I mean, so they are, they do need to be some brainiac people that do try to think up solutions for shit. But on the same hand, 
Navina. I suspected you were smart. Being said, make sure you got the fucking solution before you start making the economy and everything hurt over it. Man, we're trillions in debt that uh, I think can honestly be uncalled for. I mean, and, uh, you know, the sad thing is, we're not going to pay it. We're going to pay you a lot of it, but it's less on your kids, man. Who pays? I mean, uh, if, uh, you know, it's going to be like a road cut. Uh, the, uh, the country is going to end up going broke of uh, bad bills and shitty presidents. I mean, uh, I mean, I have to be totally fucking honest uh, that, uh, and I don't give a fuck if they're Democrat, Republican, or uh, independent. Money talks and bullshit walk, dude. I mean, seriously. And when you think that they're not corrupt and that they can't be bought, well, I think you're doing something wrong up in them bills because they can on both sides of the party. Uh, uh, to me, uh, a fucking uh, a politician is no different than a lawyer. They're bottom feeders. They're, they're nothing but lies and anything to get what they want and, and they go in life. You know. I mean, seriously, and people that, uh, he's got them down me dead. Come on, brother. I mean, honestly, man. I've always said it helps you want to get technical. Uh, I'd love to see one politician get off their ass and not lie and do for the veterans and the military uh, and give them the dues they honestly got owed to them. I mean, you know, uh, to me, <coughs> that is honestly and true. Uh, where the credit and, and shit. Hey, without those guys, man, they're not going to be, uh, nobody's going to be around. The I their city fucking more important, but I mean, uh, then, then they'll send them out to country and bring them back and, uh, and not even give them the fucking booze, but I mean, You don't get no sadder than that. And then, uh, the, uh, then the public in general talks shit about them, will hate on them. You look how uh, the, uh, the guys from the Vietnam era uh, that served got hated on. Man, a lot of those guys have passed on, dude, and, and never did get the the, uh, uh, the requisition they ever should have got, man. I mean, straight up truthful. They never. Uh, here it was, uh, the uh, the World War II veterans, and God God knows they were heroes. Uh, but and, and and no less was the Vietnam veterans or the Korean War veterans. Uh, that ne uh, if you want to get technical, the wars uh, that war never uh, still to the day never ended. You know so. I mean, seriously, uh, that war still never ended. I mean, and, and to be technical about it. <coughs> I really like the Cold War with Russia. And, and uh, look at that, Bill. Uh, Russia sent their self broke with that. I mean, seriously. Russia absolutely devastated and 
bowed their country and, and their people of a war that, that was uh, that was uh, that existed that didn't exist. I mean, you know. Uh, so, <coughs> I mean, say but fucking true, dude. I mean. Yeah, I think I took white gold turbo. And I was I mean shit dude. All in all. I mean, look at all the billions we spent, all the spies. The people for treason and all this shit. I mean, it honestly is shit. As, uh, you look at all that, and as a nation, uh, people uh, hated each other. Uh, I, I mean, I grew up in a time they. We honestly worried about getting those, I mean, it was, uh, and we thought to prepare for it, I mean, true shit, we were honestly taught to prepare to get nuked out, and, and man, that had some of the awful feelings that we were wasn't. Then when people started coming up with that shit, Donald Trump would, Trump would get us sort of nuclear war and all that shit, I don't know. I just never, uh, I was always kind of hoping we was really beyond, uh, beyond that dude because, uh, you know, uh, I worried too much about that as a, as a kid and, uh, uh, I just don't think that's something that our kids should have to worry about, dude, I mean. Damn, bro, you down again, friend. Uh, <coughs> you gotta stay out of the spray, bro. And, uh, True bullshit, they down in the conference. Shitty times we live in, bro. I mean, it's all coming back again, though. Just, just like in the in the fifties and sixties of the racial wars, and and, and that's popping back up. But it, it it's a different genre. It's the blacks have turned on the whites this time instead of the whites on the black. And and that's a true true story there, dude. I mean, straight up. 
that's a true story that the blacks have turned on the whites and they think they're superior just like the whites did with the blacks and uh I mean, honestly, they uh, they honestly think that they're superior, and the whites did the bike. So you know, let's just be honest, sir. You know, um, I don't know if I want to run. Uh, we'll find out. As everybody's leaving. I'm out here, bro. They left. But uh, it's already warm up. I'm going to turn that motherfucker back on, dude. I just, yeah, I'm just saying, yeah. Uh, got me some cold breeze going on in this bitch. But uh, it must be hotter than a motherfucker outside, man. That uh, goes to my phone. Uh, but uh, I don't know, man. I mean, you know, it's... Uh, I, uh, you know, I, 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 I say all the time, I grew up in good times, and I really did, but I also grew up in scary times, because, you know, I did grow up in the in the era of the Cold Wars and stuff like that, and I, I mean, when Reagan and, and them got together, dude, and they convinced them to tear that wall down in Berlin, man, I was so fucking ecstatic and happy about that, dude, because... You look how long those uh, German people stayed under occupation. And that's not right in itself, dude. Even though the, uh, they had a had a terrible man as a dictator. Well, uh, 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 I don't even know if you could call uh, Hitler a dictator. He was more of a... Uh, of a um, Your soul is not... You have signed the twins and the chains. Basically, of what we uh, based the grounds of a president on, uh, you know, but oh, right here, up here. As always. <coughs> and damn, dude, I mean, that was, and that man, I mean, went down in history as. One of the terrible spur, uh, uh, human beings ever walked the face of the earth. I mean, <coughs> he was beyond evil, man. I mean, seriously. Adolf Hitler went beyond evil. And, uh, you know, I'd be the first to say the black people were done wrong. Seriously. And, uh... <coughs> I mean, honestly, not just saying it and, and trying to sound not racist, but they were done wrong. They were done really wrong. But uh, you don't you don't hear the Jewish people crying and slanging snot like the blacks do over uh, uh, the way they were done. And trust me, the way they were done was terrible. I mean, straight up fucking terrible, the way they were done. I, there, there's no comparison of uh, uh, the way uh, the the uh, the blacks were done compared to the uh, uh, to the Jew uh, to the Jews, dude. Uh, <coughs> they were attacked absolutely straight out, dude, I, and uh, I'm for sure. Uh, nobody took uh, took their skin and made lamps from it. I mean, uh, and that went on, man. I, that's cold hard facts, dude. Uh, anytime you you want to look it up, they they were a lamp not long ago, uh, a few years back. That was uh, that they had found that they had thought was made of human skins during World War Two. That really were, man. And it wasn't only the German men that were doing that shit. The German women did it too, because who the hell you think made the fucking lamps? I mean, and uh, that whole country got obsessed with 
Hitler, man, and, uh, <clears throat> I mean, seriously, that whole fucking country got obsessed with him, dude, and went to the extent to extinct a race from the face of the earth. I mean, a culture, a race, because they are a race, the Jewish people were, and they went so far to it, tried to extinct them, and, uh, and to me, man, they, they have so much pride to them, dude, that, that, uh, I mean, and the Indians, what about the Indians, man, you don't never hear anybody talk about them anymore, look how, look how the white man come in and took all their shit, I mean, they, they took their shit and put them on reservations, dude, and then slaughtered them. And I come from Indian Heritage, and, uh, which I think most, <coughs> a, a lot of the majority of, uh, of, uh, Americans do come from, uh, Native American Heritage, and, uh, you know, uh, so what, they give them a few fucking casinos and throw them on a goddamn re reservation, man? Yeah. I mean, that's to make it, you look what they get for fucking New York, dude. I mean, seriously, they bought New York from the Native Americans for pennies, rather. I mean, shit. And, uh, and, and that's something we're losing in, in today's culture. We're losing the heritage of the Natives. They don't, they don't got their own fucking day. And trust me, dude, they were traded a hell of a lot worse than the blacks was. Uh, blacks were just took and made slaves out of, and Indians were slaughtered by the thousands, millions, and, uh, I mean, uh, then everybody w wants to feel sorry for somebody of these fucked up deals and bullshit, and, uh, 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 we're expected, uh, to, uh, uh, get rep uh, reformation for what our forefathers did. Well, I hate to break it to you. I come from the hills of fucking West Virginia, and, uh, I mean, straight up, not being an arrogant asshole about it, I'm getting straight honest. I come from the hills of West Virginia, and, and we were a poorer state anyway, so we didn't have slaves. You know, we couldn't afford them. Goddamn, we worked for the man in the coal mines, and, and uh, ended up having to raise her own goddamn war and get slaughtered to, to break that chain, you know. <clears throat> so we were done no better than they were, you know, if, if you want to get technical when it comes to that deal. Hey, I know him. Hey, man, what's up? I mean, seriously. And, uh, <coughs> uh, it's always, oh, we got done this way, oh, we got done that way. I mean, fuck it, suck it up, man. Uh, be your own man. Make your own fucking world for yourself. Don't go back on the past you can't live, or, I mean, uh, it makes us who we are, and we shouldn't ever forget it. But on the same hand, you're not living, or it wasn't you got done that fucking way. I mean... And, and I probably get hate over saying the shit I do, but it's the truth, man. As, 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 as white people, we were put off in certain um, uh, um, um, categories that here it is that you they think that you know either you're a wit, rich white person. So they'll, they'll have a little bit of respect for you because, you know, who don't the rich? Uh, black, white, yellow, what, what the fuck ever. Everybody kisses the rich's ass. And uh, <coughs> that's a fact. And uh, then you have middle class, and then they start. Uh, but, oh, but then again, it's in the geographic area you live in, too, you know, because uh, uh, Southerners are considered redneck trash. Hillbillies are considered trash all the way around, and 
a lot of them don't get thirds of fucking difference there, you know, when it comes to hillbillies. And, uh, hillbillies and, and rednecks are a totally different group. Or, you know, we are a, uh, a, a real, take real pride in her, in her heritage. And, uh, which I, I think, I think the, the uh, Southerns do too. But, you know, let's just be honest. They were known for slaves and, and, uh, generally in bad shit. Uh, uh, and uh, the struggle wasn't all that real for them, let's just be honest. And uh, most are arrogant assholes, uh, yeah, uh, to be straight up honest, sir, too. And uh, I mean, seriously, you know, you want to be honest about shit. Most of them are asses and, and old, old rage and bullshit. And, uh, you know, because you always got this raging southerner uh, on, on, a, on a cod game or that... Uh, it, it's uh, uh, nothing but a douche, you know what I mean? But you got them, uh, these little rich, preppy, fucking yuppie motherfuckers uh, doing the same damn shit, thinking their shit don't stink, and then you got the motherfuckers who lives in the city, think they they just fucking cold-hearted gangsters and, and bullshit, and half, half, these, half these black boys won't pull their pants up off their ass there, man. They, uh, ain't nobody wants to look at their fucking ass. They need to pull their pants up. We all wear underwear, dude, and it's all different colors and styles, you know what I'm saying? I mean, uh, and my point of the whole damn thing is, you are who you are regardless, uh, uh, and you make yourself who you fucking are. It's not your color or your uh, heritage that, that makes... It, it has something to do with it, you know, don't get me wrong, but... It, 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 it don't make you. I mean, uh, I mean, seriously, it don't make you. And uh, you make you're your own man. You make yourself. And uh, who many uh, lose sight of that? That you know, you're your own man. You ma you make yourself. And uh, that uh, <coughs> I mean, seriously. Too many goddamn make, uh, they just, it's sad, dude. And kids nowadays, they think they're thugs, gangsters, and all, all kinds of shit, and they just need to pull their fucking pants up, wipe their snot goddamn nose, and, and start being a man. I mean, straight up, man. Instead of being a little thug. Uh, that's why the prisons are overpopulated. I mean, be, uh, surprise people. Be a man. Don't be a fucking thug. Get out. Have a job, have a life, have a family, uh, take care of your kids, you know, be the cut above instead of the normal, uh, uh, and, and, and blacks, they get uh, racially profiled, you know, I, I mean, you know, let's be honest, they do, uh, and they are good black people, and there's good white people, and there's bad white people, and there's bad black people, and I'm, I'm for sure there's bad all the way around the whole goddamn nine yards, you know, let's be honest. <coughs> but you don't judge the whole goddamn mankind for one fucking person. I mean, just because a few white, uh, a few southern states decided they was going to enslave them. Uh, 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 do bad shit to them. Don't mean uh, the whole goddamn United States did. I mean, straight up, man. That's profiling your own damn self. When 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 you think like if you, if you, if you're Mexican, Puerto Rican, or whatever, and you and you start judging on them. I mean, and, and, and let's face it, you know, they get judged probably a hell of a lot more nowadays than black people do. I mean, and they don't get a fur shake, you know. It's everybody, oh, well, are you Mexican? You fucking jump the border there and it's mad shit. And a lot of uh, Mexican people are here, born and raised here, you know. Uh, have all the rights to be here as anyone else. And, 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 uh, we all come from somewhere. I don't agree with the immigration deal. Uh, I, I agree that you should be here right. I do agree to that. 
that you're paying taxes and and doing the same as the next man. I agree a hundred percent with that because without that going on in society about uh, I, uh, you know I can honestly say I never worked a job that, I, that was for cash because I know there's going to be a point in time that I would want to retire and so therefore I didn't work a job that didn't pay taxes and uh, believe you me there were plenty to be had in that deal uh, of, of uh, I think that a lot of um, foreigners get uh, profiled as they're taking jobs and they're not paying taxes which in some cases is true and I think that's uh, what a lot of, of uh, uh, American citizens or fighting against and like California don't want to enforce the immigration laws and <clears throat> now the government's talking about cutting California completely out of the loop which as much pot as they sell there man they should be fine you know as far as that goes the government money really shouldn't matter that much to them because god damn uh, we're talking about uh, Bollywood or that uh, the uh, uh, that 90 percent of, of uh, the actors and all this live in uh, that uh, should be a thriving state has went broke numerous fucking times I mean and plus legalized marijuana and stuff <coughs> and it's not bad man I'm not talking down because I think that's one of the one of the uh, one of the better things that they have done is legalize that and I think all states should legalize marijuana because for one thing they, they would get the kids off the hard shit like the pills and the bullshit that they end up dying on you know uh, not an, uh, but no uh, it's, it, it's a taboo drug that, that uh, they passed laws back in the fucking 30s and 40s on that uh, and then you had Nixon had the war on uh, on on uh, drugs, and, and but you also had the fucking government. I mean, true shit. The government what? takes. Huh? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, dude. Christian. GD. Oh Lord. <coughs> you when you know one to come along. All righty, dude. I don't know what you're wanting about, but. Uh, let me ask you something, dude. How do you have a, a 1,103 subs and you don't have no content? I mean, just to wonder. Choose your words wisely, dude. But if you want to get in on the discussion, have at it. I mean, <coughs> all right, uh, you know, like I was, uh, it's like I lost the train of thought there. But I mean, yeah, seriously, if you if you want to go uh, at those directions, be fair about it. Think about the Indians, the Jewish people, and it's all not just black. Uh, I think I think uh, anymore that's the biggest race car that can be pulled by even saying, in my opinion, like it or not, still yet yeah, that's my opinion. I th I think that that anymore that, that it's not just. It's more of a social statement that how the white man puts the black people down, which they did, and, and uh, well, none never deny that. But on the same hand, there's a time you gotta live it down and go on because uh, be your own fucking man. Don't uh, you know? 
I mean, straight up, make your own living. Be your own man. Uh, be known for in the world for what you've accomplished, not what you got out and fucking thugged and did. I mean, uh, <coughs> seriously. I mean, a, 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 a white, black, Mexican, Chinese, Puerto Rican, what the fuck ever. If you're out thieving and thugging and your ass goes to jail, I mean, uh, straight up, whose fucking fault is that? I mean, I didn't put your ass in jail and the man ain't downing you, dude. You're doing bad shit or your fucking ass wouldn't be in jail, man. I mean... As a society, we have rapists, child molesters, killers, flat up, straight up killers. You got kids running around with fucking guns, going in schools, cutting dry on, on other classmates, killing people. Why? Because mommy and daddy didn't love me like they supposed to. I mean, goddamn, like uh, like you're the only person in, in the world that has a fucking problem that you want to pick up a gun and go out and mass kill people. I mean, what the fuck is your goddamn malfunction? Seriously. <clears throat> and, uh, and that is uh, the most true statement you'll ever hear is, why do you think that you're uh, the one that has all this hard aching trouble? And trust me, there's plenty enough to go around in the world that... Uh, uh, going into uh, picking a gun up a kid and for another thing what kind of fucking parent are you that you're letting your kids run around with fucking guns and, and you're not involved in their life enough to know that they're about to snap I mean and then, but then uh, it gets blamed off on video games and, and bullshit like that and uh, <coughs> I mean seriously uh, you know when when uh, when the the uh, school massacres started happening, first thing they wanted to blame was video games. I mean, honestly, they wanted to blame video games because they didn't want to be a fucking uh, stand up and say this is a shitty fucking parent. I mean, and and, and society for that matter, for, uh, and kind of could be blamed on the teachers and shit, but uh, for not having enough. But uh, because uh, teacher anymore, it's it's a payday. They don't care about the kids, students and stuff and they just push them through fucking school and and and, and don't uh uh it, it's sad man i mean really uh it, it, there's more to blame than than uh, uh society in general man uh, you know if, you, if you're around the person and, and you uh, and it, i think to see somebody's about to snap and go off and go to killing people uh, I think there's signs of that, man, and, and uh, you know, that uh, <coughs> that somebody is going to get retarded and, and go to shooting people. I mean, my God, and, and how many innocents has got killed in these classrooms? And, and these are yours and my kids that go to these schools that uh, they're fucking, uh, you, can't, you can't send them, man, that you got to worry uh, that uh, what kid's going to snap pack a gun in and then shoot the fuck out everybody there man I mean you know really uh, but and, and then society itself don't want to take blame for it they want to point fingers at others and I think that the biggest blame is the parents because be involved in your kid's life man don't uh, don't uh, have a kid and expect the fucking uh, Xbox PlayStation PC to be a, uh, to be your fucking babysitter to where you don't want to fucking deal with your kids. I mean, shitty burning. I mean, shitty burning. At least when I grew up, man, her parents whooped her ass, and and that's something you can't do nowadays unless you want to end up in fucking jail for uh, you. You go to Walmart uh, uh, anywhere. You see this kid there laying on the floor cutting a pit. When, when the parent probably really can't afford what the kid wants or generally trying to be a decent parent, you will buy your kids what they want and then half the time what they don't need, you know. I've done it myself uh, with my daughter. I've always tried to make sure I, she always got what she wanted and then, you know, so. But 
I mean, you know, and it's, it's not been that long. What, a few months ago, kid walks in, uh, and a teenager, mind you, now, uh, goes in and in a school and masters other kids, teachers face, you know. And uh, it's sad, very sad, man. But, uh, and uh, I'll tell you one, another one, or you ain't heard anything of since it took place, is, uh, <coughs> it's, uh, which I haven't, which I've been aiming to check into, is the kids in Chicago, the, uh, the, the, what, the four, four or five black kids that grabbed the white kid there and uh, decided they wanted to go viral on Facebook or and kidnapped him and fucking tortured him. And, and I bl believe you me, if, if that would have been a black person, uh, it would still not been left down. That it would still be all over the media, and uh, they, they would push for something to be done about that. And uh, as, as it is at this moment, and I haven't checked into it, uh, which I'm, I believe I will, because I'm, I'm really, honestly, wanting to see where that goes. Uh, about that deal, you know, because, uh, you know, black, white, whatever, uh, they had no right to kidnap him if it, if it had been five white and a black, uh, uh, kidnapping a black person. There's still no right to, to ever take anybody and torture them for your personal fucking pleasures. I mean, just because you'd uh, fucking hate on Donald Trump. I mean, really, is that the goddamn statement you want to make and you want to get that pissy and mad because Barack Obama served his fucking two terms and he's gone? I mean, really? <coughs> Basically? Uh, and uh, young fucking kids, for one thing, that really don't understand politics. Uh, but, but they made it racist. I mean, they chose to make it racist their own self, and this, uh, I mean, really think about it, this is the mindset of, of, of the black kids nowadays, that they feel that they should kidnap white people and uh, torture them, demean them, put cigarettes out on them, and that kind of shit, and it's supposed to be totally acceptable. I mean, my God, you ignorant motherfucker, didn't you ever realize that you're broadcasting this live on Facebook and that your ass is going to fucking jail. I mean, Kids you... nowadays are brainwashed and the parents are the problem because they don't get involved. Exactly, Jeff. Exactly. I mean, a kid's got a mindset that they can fucking kidnap another kid. And they, all these kids are, are at the age of, of young adults that should and really should be tried as adults. And if you can't throw race crime, uh, race hating in on that deal, man, I don't know what the fuck you do on it. Because have, have you, have you uh, read in the, uh, about that, Jeff, about the the, the, uh, the four black kids that, uh, in Chicago that uh, kidnapped the white kid and was uh, had it live on Facebook or them uh, torturing him and shit? I mean, I've seen the fucking video for it. They removed it and shit because it went viral where it really did. They got what they wanted about it going viral, but goddamn, I mean, really? How bad did that look on the black race? That they, uh, that they're, I mean, you, you know, here it is, they're going on the white people, saying, oh, you enslaved us, you done this and that, and all this bullshit to us, uh, but here they are, uh, kidnapping white people, uh, fucking torturing them. I mean, uh, <laughs> It don't look too damn good in my book. I mean, goddamn, if you want to make a statement, do it like Martin Luther King did. Don't fucking be a, 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 a that's, a, that's just race hating, man. I, I, you know, and they, uh, you hear about, oh, the Ku Klux Klan, the Ku Klux Klan, the skinheads, and all these motherfuckers. And I ain't got nothing for them, I'll just be honest about it. But on the same hand, uh, the bikes got the Black Panthers, and, and uh, they've done bad shit, too, so, you know, it's, it's, even, uh, I guess they figure they're leveling the playing field. It's going to be race wars, man, if they don't stop their shit. I mean, we all going to have to live in this world like it or love it, you know. We can either do it in, uh, and be known for what we've done as a human being, 
in good ways, or you'll go down in history as being a piece of shit. I mean, seriously. <coughs> Who the fuck is stupid enough to kidnap somebody and then fucking put it on Facebook and do it live? I mean, goddamn, you're going to the fucking penitentiary, man, because you're giving no evidence on your fucking self. How the hell are you going to deny it, I helped a guy the other night. He said it was too hard to make gold. Oh. I showed him what to do, and he said that today he's already made over. Uh, you're the man that can teach a feller how to make gold, Jeff. That's a fact, man. Dude, you... <laughs> I know you said the other day you was down to a few thousand, uh, like, uh, way under your cushion, dude. How much have you made since, since then? LOL. <coughs> I mean, I, I, I know I, I get into controversial shit, Jeff, but I'm, I mean, seriously, dude. Society at, uh, on a, in general, man, hates on each other, and that's sad, man. Uh, did you get the, uh, did you get the, uh, the email from my uh, YouTuber, dude, uh, that, uh, they sent out everybody. I haven't got none yet. I got a notification uh, that I would get it, but I haven't got it yet. So I'm just wondering what that's going to be, dude. Uh, more changes and rules, dude. He said, and he made eight rounds of my crack rouge. Root. Yeah. Oh, you got a good root, man. I, 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 uh, your route is superb, dude. I mean, honestly. Not uh, sure. <coughs> yeah, I, I got a notification, or, you know, your notifications will pop up like uh, somebody you're subbed and stuff. I got one. I thought it was you or somebody streaming and was going to go watch it and clicked on it and looked, and it was a notification telling me that there there was new changes and, and stuff like that. I'm just kind of itching to see what they are, you know. I, I think it's about safe to save trolling's, uh, uh, you know, I think it's about safe to say trolling's damn near cut out. But I on the same hand, it's probably be another way of, uh, of just putting bullshit rules in on being rougher on small channels, though, I mean... I, I mean, seriously, right now, small channels don't get, uh, they get fucking yanked around, dude. I mean, seriously, yeah. they're a the constant getting up bullshit, you know, uh, uh, we can't, uh, 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 can't monetize your video uh, for blah, blah, and all that shit, man. I mean, uh, uh, just, uh, just over some ways, sometimes how you like this one here. I know good and damn well it ain't going to get monetized after I'm done with it, but I just I just figured that was a good topic. <laughs> I haven't streamed since last weekend. Oh, you haven't? Damn. So I'm caught up with you then. <laughs> I thought it was yours, man. <coughs> how, how, how's, how's it going on your house, man? I haven't did any more to mine, dude. I, I'm... I'm I'm up floating around a 50k mark and can't get above it, dude. I mean, uh, seriously, I'm up floating around 50k and I had my cushion. Now I bought that fucking staff or motif for these staffs right here. That staff I'm using, which goddamn ended up being about 144k all the way around. The time I changed both staffs, and I've been broke motherfucker ever since then, dude. Haven't done a lot on it. Making gold right now. Oh, make it go right now. I need to do some, but honest to God, Jeff, I just, uh, okay, like bone. I got it now, man, and I've been having trouble finding it. You know how bone is, I end up getting in game. Where the fuck can you buy a bone at? Uh, I've looked in the guild traders, and I can't get it to come up for me. You know what I mean? I mean, I cannot get it to come up, Jeff, the bone. I can't get it. I, I, like, um, in my search engine for it, I can't find it, man. And, uh, I know it, it drops off of, uh, 
book bags, shit like that. Uh, but it's takes it takes two hundred bone to make the test dummy with fifty work rates to get the other piece you need and some Monday stones which is not so bad. Uh, but like I've I would buy it to be honest, but I can't find it. I mean I, I went into um uh, oh shit I had to damn it. I went into crafting. I go into uh, and uh, you make them in uh, and enchanting. Not sure on that one. But it, they don't come up in enchanting. You know what I mean? It, it, it would be more of a. Uh, let's see what else uh, you make in them. It, it comes up in. Uh, 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 I think it's a uh, dark elf, dark elf style. I have to go to a workbench and make sure on that one. But uh, which I would buy from a merchant if. It can be bought that way, which I haven't. That just struck me. I haven't checked the merchant to see if he sells bone. Talking about bone. Mm hmm. Bone. Yeah, bone, Jeff. You know, the. Uh, um, uh, I'll show you, dude. It comes up in. Uh, one style's made with it. And I got to. I, I come out of fucking up making that. Um, what bone I do have with it. Let's see, creation, do, 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 do. oh, um, it's back here, because I'm sitting on two, what else, what else made with bone? But the uh, test dummies, they're made with bone too. I got enough to make one that uh, Alex gave me enough, thing, and I thank him so much for it, which I was going to make one and sell it, um, you know. <coughs> Because uh, if I could get 50k, I made money on it. You know what I mean? I made fairly good on it. But, but I was going to ask about 55 to 60 because they're they're, they're asking 65 to 70k for them. So I was going to ask about 55, 60. Materials, style materials. Style materials. Yep. So I should be able to buy them right here off this guy, shouldn't I? Less fashion. Let's check him out. Uh. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. Oh, my God. Let's see what 200 is going to cost me. Because I, I got enough that I can make two test dummies with 200 of them. With 200 more, of that is. A thousand. So a stack will be three K. That's not bad. I mean, three K is not bad. That's not bad at all. Three K on a stack. I got enough. To, now, now that made me. I have enough to make two of them. I have to go back and buy another. Uh, the uh, I'll show you the other thing that you put with them. I got plenty of Monda stones, so I'm good there. And uh, let me open these, dude, and see what we get. Mazatom bows. I don't have. I don't know not hardly any Mazatom. Um, clockwork control panel. Damn hell yeah. Uh, Ah, uh, motif, another axe, already known, so I can sell that one. Um, yeah, I need that stuff, always. Um, uh, another cardboard control panel. Wonder what those sell for, I'll have to go check. And, uh, ah, uh, I already know them. I know all them, because I, I got those when I was doing the, uh, for, uh, uh, all the, uh, copper boxes on the, uh, uh, trials. So I've ended up knowing all those. So I know that one. Uh, I already know that one. Don't know the mother damn bows. Which would probably sell pretty good. Uh, I know, now I know one of them, so I can sell one. Gotta give that to Alex. Damn, I ain't got that much out to, done today. Is, oh shit. So I got two. I got one, two, one. Just two, got home three. from picking up my kids from school. Are you home, Alex? <coughs> so I've 
I've got two I can sell, and I can make two target dummies and sell those. Let me go to enchanting. Let me do better. I'll just go to my house. Easier. A lot easier to just go to my house and uh, be done with it. <coughs> so I can make two target dummies and sell. If I sell them 50k a piece, oh shit, I shouldn't have traveled. God damn it. I'm going to have to come back out and then go back to uh, Grothwood to pick up the other, uh, the other uh, piece I'm needing. So I might as well travel right back. That'll make me two of them to sell. Which, uh, the reason I've decided I'd start selling those, Jeff, don't take a lot of work rates to get them. And, uh, damn, see, there's another, another goddamn thing. Everything I put in that one guild is not sold. Though the, 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 uh, it's, I'll show you the guild. Um, I fucked up and put them in it anyway. I could probably put up my other guild and sell them, but uh, eh, I ain't going to, you know what I mean? Fuck it, I'll just break it down or give it to a, uh, sell it to a fucking merchant. Uh, I'm sitting on quite a, a lot of shit I'm getting ready to throw in. And the one I paid the dues to be in. I, I mean, I, you know, I'm sorry, but uh, these free guilds, uh, you don't sell your shit in half the time, man. I mean, you see, like right now, I'm getting shit back, and it's, uh, it's, uh, this guild, this guild, and they have a trader as the funny thing. They say they do, but goddamn, man, I'm not, uh, Okay, Monday daily farm, daily motif farming. They're farming fucking motifs. Uh, hey, the surprising thing, man, I've got a few in my guild. <laughs> uh, oh shit! Oh god! I got enough to keep a bank space. <laughs> oh, that's all I cared about. I just wanted that goddamn extra bank space. Uh, deep blue, deep blue. Where the fuck did I get in this one? Yeah. PSN community. Da, da, da. Hey, uh, end up with a new Discord, Jeff. I'm gonna have to give you the uh, uh, the shit for it, man. Because uh, uh, I got it on my phone app, and uh, man, I can't work that motherfucker. I mean, seriously, I cannot work it. And I know you taught me how to work it, but but my goddamn computer crashed on me, and I've had to reboot it, and I've lost uh, half half my goddamn shit, and I. Uh, I stay about half, half and half. I think we all know that when it comes to me. One, two, three, four, five on them, five fucking guilds. No, I can't have that. Somebody's got to go. That's Blondie's guild there, dude. <laughs> shit. Or I mean, she's got up in that motherfucker. Let's check it out. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, she don't look bad, does she, Alex? I mean, I'm, I'm here to tell you, she, she's a fat man. It, it, it's tor it's pure tormenting I like to do on that deal, dude. Yeah, I'm just saying. Uh, it's one of my SO tendencies I got to be. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, God help me, Lord. I, I got my rocks off making her blush, man. I, I, I'm just saying. Oh Lord, she's a she's a fucking mess, man. But uh, in a good way, she's a good person, as, as you know, she honestly is. Uh, oh, how strong! But she's a good person, and she thinks I'm a pure fucking asshole, man. I mean, honest to God, she thinks I'm a pure ass. I don't know why she likes me. What is it about women like assholes, dude? I don't get that. I mean. You try, uh, nor uh, I mean anybody that knows me knows I'm, I am a, a good person. I'm, I mean, try to be anyway. I, I don't know any more about me, man. Uh, the more I play this game, the more I fucking become an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, shit. I try to keep my my good tendencies to me, but 
God damn, it ain't hard to lose it, man, when you're dealing with a douchebag in a fucking dungeon, is it? I mean, I know you know what I'm talking about, Alex. God damn, go through. I mean, I really honestly hate voting people out, but God, like that one douchebag we was playing with the other day, or man, hey, I, I swear to you, that fucking retard motherfucker, man, he had me so goddamn mad, dude. LOL. I mean, I mean he would honestly, dude. He would go tank the goddamn thing and fighting against us, dude. I mean, absolutely, just flat out fighting against us. Did not want, oh shit. I gotta do something real quick, guys. I, I mean, I hate to do it, but I, I'm losing track of doing it. I'm gonna put me on some coffee real quick while I get this shit started. I, I'm starting to freeze again. I gotta turn this fucking air conditioner off. It's a shame, man. <laughs> Hey, uh, is it just me, Jeff, or do you go through hot flashes as you get older, dude? I mean, I, I'll fucking burn them. For, I believe it's just where I'm sick, oh. <coughs> and, and now I'm, uh, I'm going to cause myself to get even sicker because it's been so goddamn hot I can't stand it where I can't breathe any fucking way. I mean, honestly, dude, I, I've been having some breathing issues. I've had them check me out. They all tell you quit smoking. I mean, you know, that, that's a parent that I need to quit smoking. I mean, it's I've smoked so many years, dude, that it's easier said than done, man. I mean, honestly, it's easier, a lot easier said than done when it comes. Let me go ahead and, uh, let me go ahead and sign, uh, let's see. I think she... Kikio, yep, Kikio's about done. That's the healer. <coughs> um, I mean, you know, to be honest, I wish I'd never picked a fucking cigarette up and smoked it. But um, it was the thing back when I growed up, you know. It honestly was. Uh, Jeff growed up in that era. He, he knows what I'm talking about, man. I get allergies this time of year. I think that's a lot of my problems, too, that, that I've got some allergies, too, man. And uh, I need to uh, to talk with my doctor about that. That uh, <clears throat> And I, I've had asthma since I was a kid, to be honest. And, and shouldn't have never really ever been smoking. But, uh, but I mean, I, I mean, uh, it's, uh, it's an easy habit to start, and it's a nasty habit. I mean, a, a, a lot. I have. I, I've had brand new shirts that I've I burned holes in, and 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 fuck, throw them away, dude, or use them to work around the house in and shit. Because I mean, nice clothes. I burn holes in and shit, dude. And I'll be the first to say, and I'm proud to say, my daughter, she my don't mouth. smoke or like the smell of it. She's done. Yay. So that's another one completely ranked up. And uh. Yeah, my daughter, she she despises the smell of smoke. She'll tell me all the time when she's around me to put out cigarettes, she don't like smoke. And uh, and I'm really proud of that. My, my oldest brother that got killed when, uh, when I was 17, he didn't smoke. But my twin brother, he smokes, and my sister smokes. And uh, me and her both are, are, are we, we, we're just addicted to coffee. Me and my twin sister is, or me and my sister is. But me, my twin brother don't like coffee he won't drink it he, he says he don't like the taste of it <coughs> she's ranked up she's ranked up she's ranked up this one's close <coughs> and uh, you know one I can't be around smoke I have some breathing issues I think lungs that, close up <coughs> a lot of people don't and you know I think it is a good thing Jeff that they made it about you know smoking in uh, it's hard on me when we have the fires around here yeah I would say dude I would honestly say uh, you know uh, why I keep smoking to be honest and me with asthma it's a habit man and it's a hard habit to break I've tried vaping I honestly have uh, <coughs> It chokes me even worse, or dude. That, but, but everybody says that I'm I'm getting the wrong uh, that I'm getting the wrong. Uh, I'm I think I'm gonna try it again to try to quit smoking My again bouncer. because uh, it's it's more of the habit of uh, of uh, puffing on it. I swear I believe that's uh, the 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 big thing of it is to uh, uh, 
I've, I've heard people say take straws, just something they, uh, uh, to puff on, uh, like that, which <coughs> it's the nicotine, too, let's just be on it. And uh, they put shit in cigarettes to addict you. I mean, really, cigarettes is more addictive than marijuana because I did used to smoke marijuana. I won't lie, when I was younger, I smoked pot. And uh, to me, it was it was nothing to quit smoking it. I mean, yeah, and as far as drinking, I never had uh, um, a big, uh, the taste of alcohol just sickens me. I mean, I got uh, I got on a drunk when I was in my 20s, and that one was the one that, uh, you know, weaned me from drinking. Every now and then I might drink a, a beer or a, uh, and I despise beer, man, I hate the taste of it, or a uh, uh, a cup of liquor socially, I, I, but it, it, I mean, we're talking years past before. I just don't like the taste of it, and and I don't feel the pressure of people, you know, oh, drink a beer with me or whatever. I, it's not me, man. I just uh, don't like it. My, my nephew, he drinks a lot, really probably too much, and... Uh, he uh, he goes on me all the time. Oh, drink a beer with me. Let's get drunk and shit. I don't My mouth. like the feeling. I mean, you know, uh, because for one thing, uh, everybody is a pony drunk when they first start it. But uh, I think the longer that someone drinks, the meaner they get, and you end up being a mean drunk because. Uh, some people's comical drinking, and they know their limit, and uh, and then there's some people that don't know their limit, and they uh, uh, and and let's just be honest, there's some people that's really just friggin' addicted to it, and uh, it's uh, I think alcohol is uh, way worse than uh, marijuana because <coughs> of people uh, you can't die on it I mean let's be honest you can die of alcohol poisoning and you can literally drink yourself to death I mean you know uh, if you do it in moderation it's like anything but some people cannot do it in moderation and uh, I used to work with this guy and uh, he uh, he was an alcoholic. I mean, he was a full fledged alcoholic. He would not do it what time we were working. My are bred strong. But just as soon as we got off work, uh, he would go to drinking. And I mean, he could drink uh, from. Got to get back to work. <coughs> All righty, Jeff. Uh, uh, he could drink from one. Running a little late. Oh gosh. Uh, uh, anyway, that guy, he could drink from one convenience store to another. He would buy 12. He'd buy him a 12 pack or 6 pack. It depended. Because, you know, there's a bunch of convenience stores on the way home from work. And uh, he would, uh, he would literally, he could drink them from one to the other. And then at the last one, before we would get home, he would, uh, he would just buy him a, few, a couple cases, and he would drink that much. He would drink till he go to bed. And you know if you drink like that, man, you're, you're going to get up drunk. I mean, uh, we've all did it, you know, getting up drunk. Uh, <coughs> when I was young, I'd do it just because everybody was doing it. And, uh, you know... I think we all get like it, uh, uh, you know, just to fit in and and stuff like that. Uh, I honestly would, but I never did like the taste of it, and I never drank it uh, in big uh, amounts. And then one uh, New Year's, I got shit faced drunk, and uh, from that point on, uh, alcohol in general just made me uh, I, the smell of it to be honest even now makes me sick and to smell it on another person 
um, makes me uh, makes me sick too, man. I mean, I mean, the smell of alcohol all the way around just honestly makes me sick. And uh, and 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 quitting smoking marijuana was easy, man. I mean, honestly. Uh, and I smoked it daily. I mean, I, you know, you could pretty well call me a pothead. And uh, um, time come that my job called for death. And, uh, you know, you're going to work or you're going to preload on drugs. I mean, simple as that. I mean, it is honestly simple as that. Are, are you going to work and be productive or are you going uh, to... Uh, uh, be a drug addict and still and be a, uh, be a little thug to friggin' do your habit. I think that uh, if anyone has a habit and they're paying for that habit, that's their business. But when you're stealing from your family and your friends and stuff like that to do, to do your thing, and which you see it a lot, a, a lot, or if you're selling your body in some women's cases. <coughs> I hate to do something, but I am going to do something right here. And I, I, I think you'll just think, God damn, he ain't going to do it. Yeah, I am going to do it. I, I, uh, I'm going to do it in a different way. I, I, I don't like her looks that good. So I am going to delete her, and I'm going to do it right now. Before I get any further in with her, I'm, I'm, going, I'm going to sell her shit off and delete her. Sad but true. Uh, and then I'm I'm going to go ahead and remake her. Uh, I don't like her. Uh, uh, ground four or five mil. Sell that. Sell that. I put that in the bank. Those are kind of petty, but I put them in the bank. Let me get my banker out. Um, I don't. Uh, I honestly don't like her look. I mean, seriously. I think I can do a better job on her looks, and I'm thinking maybe of a dark elf instead of a, instead of a uh, high elf with her. Speak with me a moment. I'm I'm going to research a little bit before I build her. To be honest, uh, I can't deposit. Oh, I can't deposit that because I got it. Uh, off of uh, her level ups on her level ups so I'll fix that if you can't use it fuck it huh. let's go ahead and use it you know what I'm saying Swallables. anywho um, I don't like her looks man I mean seriously I made her and I honestly don't like her looks Uh, to me, it's uh, yeah. I honestly just don't like her looks. She's uh, too um, narrow jawed and shit. I, I, I didn't take my time. I hurried and made her, and uh, I honestly just don't like her looks. And I got so many redheads. I mean, uh, I only got two redheads I love, and. Uh, she S and her just can't be one of them, so I am going to delete her. <coughs> I, I I feel I'm uh, going to be wasting my time with her, so therefore uh, not wasting it on her itself. I don't think I'll ever be satisfied with her looks. Cause let's just be honest, man. She she's uh she kind of ugly. I mean, a whole kind of ugly. The dark elves you expected out of you know they're they're pale skinned and even as a vampire, you know. But they they're still hot. I mean, you know, seriously. Even even to this ugly old bitch, here, she's still got a hot ass tendency to her, and hers about the same way. But 
you know the dark elves you, you see it but the the high elves or uh they're uh they look better and and and, and i might make it a breton to be honest um i rushed in uh, to the belt on her and I mean, seriously, I honestly rushed into the building and uh, 